In court, uh, one count of murder in the first degree. A judge agreed to find probable cause in the case of a 14 year old arrested. He's accused of shooting and killing an Ingram High School student. These proceedings are happening a day after this. It's horrifying when you hear that you can do anything. A chaotic scene outside of this campus. The timeline is still terrifying for the students and parents who lived it. Just before 10 a.m. on Tuesday, Seattle police say they received reports of a shooting in North Seattle. The gunfire happening inside Ingram High School. Officers arrived, entered the school, and found one student with a gunshot wound. As medics moved in to help, the campus went into lockdown with police searching for the shooter. Shortly after 11 a.m., police provided the update. A person in custody. Sky King was overhead as officers arrested a 14-year-old in connection with the shooting. Today, he waived his first court appearance. Based off what we have so far from Seattle Police investigators, and this case is still ongoing, we believe that there was probable cause for first-degree murder, which is premeditated. The prosecuting attorney's office says a 15-year-old who was allegedly with the 14-year-old and in possession of a firearm is in custody, too. His parents told the judge what he's being accused of is not like him at all. How many been in trouble before? As for the teenager who lost his life, the prosecutor explained the grief from that tragedy is why his family was not in this room today. I was told that the victim's mother had recently been admitted to the emergency room last night due to circumstances potentially surrounding yesterday's incident. The two teens have no previous cases with the King County Prosecuting Attorney's Office. That office does expect to receive more information from Seattle Police by Monday. After that, that office can file a charging decision. In Seattle, Natalie Swaby, King 5 News.